And the more creative you can make a wedding, actually, the more affordable it can be. And I met one Tampa couple taking the shotgun wedding approach to a whole nother level to save money. When Gary met Melissa, he knew he hit the bullseye. And I mentioned I would really like to learn how to shoot, and so if y'all are going to the range one day, I'd love to tag along and get some pointers. Teaching her on what they now call their first date, how to shoot a gun. Taught her how to load it, where the safety was. After a year of dating, he pulled the trigger. She gets me. She gets my jokes. She's as corny as I am. <laughs> <laughs> And since their favorite date spot is Shooter's World, the bride and groom decided to take a different approach to tying the knot. It's just a fun place to be, and so when he suggested, jokingly, I think, that we should have our wedding here, I was like, sure, why not? Let's go for it. In true Second Amendment fashion, Melissa walked down the aisle decorated with shell casings, a cake topper packing heat, and heart-shaped targets for their first shots as newlyweds. Their final bill, only a few thousand dollars. Tampa Bay event planner Debbie Jones says more couples are turning to unique weddings to trim costs. Public beaches, public uh, recreational centers, that's really popular and is very cost effective. Um, we did a double wedding at one of the hotels. Saying the more out there, the cheaper it is, like at Big Cat Rescue. Now known as the Webs, Gary and Melissa say they couldn't have found a better place to get hitched. A place they'll be shooting for forever. He's the one person that can make me laugh and made me feel happiness again. And he's just a real special person. He's got a tough exterior, but he has a really soft heart. Well, this was Shooter's World's first wedding, and as a gift to the bride and groom, they are giving them a one-year membership to shoot as many rounds as they want. I love it. Christy, thank you.